Hey guys, before the video starts, I would like to ask of you, if you like the video, be sure to drop a like and sub. Also, leave a funny comment if you want to. Every little bit helps me to grow the channel so we can reach more people. Anyways, thank you guys for watching and let's get you into the video. Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Amnesia The Dark Descent. I am not gonna lie, I kind of wish I had a, a just a little, at least dim source of light so you can see my facial expressions a little bit better, but it is what it, what it is. I... That's right, I got the key for the wine cellar and uh, what is my lantern? Lantern is F. Alright, let's go into the laboratory. The statues were praying, gazing into the dark doom ceiling. Oh yeah, lovely. I, uh... Dot, dot, dot. I, I'm just silent. This mo what is this like? I'm getting mo motion sick. Oh yeah, the cockroaches! Fantastic. That is disgusting. Can you st stop? Move away? Can I burn them? Bro, I don't remember cockroaches like. Yeah, I'm not gonna look at that. There should be more Kubrat. Let me see, let me see. And one part Aqua Force. So Kubrat and Aqua Fortis. That's all chemistry pot. Okay, at least a little bit like less oh give me give me this early alchemy experiment this is my third attempt to produce artificial vitae the former compound uh, compounds lack the potency i need but i sense some close calamine and orm ormepent are given and the cuprite binds them well this time i will attempt aqua regia instead of aqua fortis in hope it will produce a more even solution the experiment was unsuccessful. The solution is highly acid and proves impractical to put to any use except as a detergent. Organic tissue reacts especially violently to the solution and should be handled with the greatest care. I might be able to use the recipe, but I'm losing hope that I will find an alchemic solution to my predicament. Cool. Where are you? I don't... One day I will return... If it wasn't for the thought of you, my love, I wouldn't be able to go on. When I find myself doing terrible things, I take comfort in you. As long as I'm able to think of you and long for a life together, I know I'm better than the others. I weep for them, they lust for power without restraint, where I only crave fair judgment and a safe return. Cool. Um, so, Aqua Vitae. Yeah, yeah. Chemical relocation. The lack of a uh, the lack of a chimney to properly vent the fumes from my most recent experiments has taken its toll on many of my less stable ingredients in storage. Some seem uh, unaffected, but many are stained by the fumes that will be difficult to salvage. I shall do what I can and move them to the wine cellar. Right. So we got the key for the wine cellar, which is good to know. By see what I mean? How many do I have? Seven. I might as well use one, right? I don't wanna... I'm just gonna sprint through. Right? I'm just gonna sprint through. How many tinder boxes I have? 11. I, um... Uh, sure, we'll... Uh, we have to get back here, so... 
The sand gave way to his tired body as he fell from the camel's back. He felt the wind gently sweep across his face and his dry, crusted lips. <laughs> Crusty fucker. This has got to be the wine cellar. Yeah, I got the key, boy. My sanity is... Okay, my sanity is in the yellow, which is... It's better than the red, I'll t I can tell you that much, right? The desert dunes were like waves in sluggish sea while the caravan moved the land up here. Motionless! <laughs> Where did the Baron go? Who cares? He left us in a wine to last us a lifetime! Or at least until tomorrow! <laughs> dude, dude, dude. Is there anything behind like usually in these type of games you need to i need to like i'm wasting oil to be perfectly honest but who really cares maybe something like in the corner nope all right i just barricaded myself because that's what a pro gamer does i uh Let's get into the bloody... Yeah. I will actually take that. How much? I just restored what I spent. That's uh... on lights buddy I'm knocked out I can't what is that no no game I just used the thing the tinder box for this right uh, to push for a strong push come on there there come on I don't want to waste any more oil than I need to, right? So... There, I know I can give it an extra push, but uh... There. I don't think I explored all of this, right? Um... Well, I am... I am... I'm going in, right? Bro. Poisoned? Uh, that My sounds. God, Wilhelm, do something! Accept it. We're not getting out of here. How can you say that? Alexander, you piece of shit! Let us out of here! Wilhelm's last words. My name is Wilhelm Hausel Gerich. These are my final words, my confession and testament. Two years ago, I was summoned to the castle Brennenburg. As most of the arist aristocracy, I was curious about what is this supposed knight of the order could want from me and accepted the invitation. The Baron was friendly and offered me a proposi proposition. It dawned on me that the nature of the contract was sordid and the reason I was chosen was because of the follies of my past and not the honors I've been rewarded with during my time as a soldier. I was to kidnap healthy humans upon his slightest whim and do so without asking questions. In return, he would attest to my character at the royal court advancing my position within noble society. I would like to claim that I struggled with my decision, but it came swiftly and I accepted it wholeheartedly. Ever since that day, I've brought men, women and children to Brandenburg. I can't remember the numbers, but there were many, perhaps even a hundred. None of whom were ever seen of her or heard of from again. Tonight, the Baron invited me and my men down to the wine cellar to celebrate our work. 
I had my suspicions as we descended the stairs, but he insisted and joined us in a toast. The wine tasted fine and my men drank without restraint. So begins the punishment for our sins. The Baron has locked us up and returned upstairs. Forgive me for what I have done. I was weak and fell into his diabolic ways. My men are screaming, their skin has been pierced by their own tangled bones. I feel my insides revolt against their God-given nature. Blood has begun to pour from my eyes and I can no longer. That's disgusting, by the way, and I don't like the... The, the creepy sound effect. I... I think I have all of the... Reagents? Ingredients? There is another... No game? Why are you doing this to me though? What is this? I am I'm gonna lose my shit man. No, he's not gone. Why is he not going, like... Bro! There's no way! And heal wounds. My... A few cuts and bruises. Sure. Bro, he's still here! What am I supposed to do? I'll just... I... I'll... I guess... Uh... I don't get it, man. Like, I, I literally don't get it. What am I supposed to do here? Fine, I'll just apparently camp in the corner and uh... I think I heard him move. Apparently not. What do you mean, man? Where did he go? Bro, I uh... <clears throat> I don't care, I'm running for it. Right? I'm just... Where? Okay, I uh... Is this it? Was I supposed to walk to him? He sat down by the Casbah well gasping for air, sweet fuck. I'll just sprint through across. I know for a fact I have some of the... Some lights turned on there, right? I should be. I th after enduring three days in Algeria, the sailboat was finally arranged to take him across the Mediterranean Sea to Gibraltar. Having reached British territory was just a matter of reserving a cabin on SS Hortensia headed for London. Can I jump? Yeah, good. Bro, I am so dis- This, like, motion blur, I am so disoriented. Yep, I agree. I agree, Daniel. It's very cold. Please? Okay. I, uh... Heal bright. Calamine. Aqua. I 
don't think that's how chemistry works, man. Four! Oh... Oh no... Four! Tinderbox... So there is no way I missed one? Oh, these are... Stupid chemistry. <laughs> I, uh... Is there a possibility it was somewhere around here, right? Did I... I'll take the tinderbox. I'll, uh... Sure, I'll use one. Yeah. Alright. No, I don't care about the sounds. I don't care. 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 Daniel, run. Now, in hindsight, how could I miss it? Because I didn't look there. Right? Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Right. Fantastic. Now I'm not jumping down. I'll get my ankles broken. I already... I'm still good? I am running low on oil. I'm not gonna fully use my oil simply because uh, uh, fully... Uh, what's it called? This is the fire. I need to do this, right? This. 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 And... Uh... Oh, I need to put... Well, actually, that makes sense if you think about it, but, uh... There. Mass... Pot of acid. I'm a master chemist. Now we can, uh... We can progress further. The claw smelled of desert and damp musk. The pieces lay scrambled on top. Too many of them, he thought, on, or perhaps too few. I forgot about the color red in this place. Please leave me alone. Thank you. All right. Progress. Close the door. Boom. I am a master chemist, refinery. After enduring three days in Algiers, Sable was finally arranged to take him across the Mediterranean Sea. Oh yeah, I read this. I thought this, uh, these was all unique, but apparently some of them, like, repeat. Bro, this is dark. It sure is dark in here. Yup. Yes. And there's a good reason for it. Great! But you can light the lamp now, if you wish. What's the reason? For the darkness, that is. Stay close. Be careful not to stray. What's the reason? Why is it so dark? Pay attention, Dandel. It's important that you keep going straight. And make sure not to stray. Phenomenal! What do I... No mementos are available. What's my... My sanity... Cle crystal clear. Well, it's not gonna be for long. Ha ha ha. Great. Giving me another hint about the enemies. Nope. Nope. 
No. 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 Okay. I don't want to waste my oil, right? <clears throat> I, um... The problem is, I don't know what am I supposed to do here. Open the door, Daniel. Open the door. Close the door. Good. I, uh... Anyone there? Uh, you know, Daniel... Probably yes, and uh, you're not gonna like what you... Second of June, it's fine. I picked up. It's been more than a month since my last entry. After the event inside the underground chamber in Algeria, Professor Herbert insisted I return to England. He said he didn't want to risk forfeiting the entire expedition lest I took a turn for the worse. An excessive decision, in retrospect. But I'm glad it turned out that way. I found my journal this morning in the haphazard collection of things brought home from Africa. Next to it lay the broken stone orb wrapped in cloth. I tried to assemble it, but couldn't. The pieces wouldn't fit together, as if they weren't from the same object. Could I have imagined it all? Was there ever a complete orb? Thank you for opening the door. You're so kind. You're very kind to me. I, uh, is there any, like, lamp? No, I've been here, so, uh... I, uh... Bro, is this just a... 25th of June, mm. 1839. I love it. I feel the need to continue this journal, even though it was intended for my journey to Africa. This must be something very important. I just know it. I've taken it upon myself to piece the orb back together, but it's been more difficult than one might think. The pieces are behaving strangely. They seem to change color, shape, and texture, but ever so slightly. Yesterday, I took careful measurements and notated any significant markings. Today, I confirmed my suspicions. <coughs> they were changing. I was terrified and rushed off to see the finest geologist in London, Sir William Smith. I approached the subject with care and we discussed how rocks change form. He told me about the nature of glass, how it eventually collapses on itself like ice slowly melting over the course of centuries. Smith eased my mind a bit, but I can't escape the feeling that these shards have otherworldly properties. I, uh, I... You piece of shit! Fine, you don't want me to go that way, I'll go this way. Great, I'm losing my sanity even in the light. Thank you, video game. Is there, like... Come on, this motion blur is, like, messing me up. Come on, Daniel, you can do it. Throw that away. You don't need that. I'm wasting my oil. And now I can't see anything. There, progress. Yep, dot, dot, dot. You gotta love it. You gotta love it, man. At least, uh... Oh. How do I... Oh, there. 
by any chance. I'll take a couple of tinder boxes, that's for damn sure. And uh, my guess is. Come on, open, open, open. I'm circling where it is. There. Run! No, I'm not looking back. He crashed through the surface, the dark Atlantic water smothered him as he struggled to make sense of the situation. I, uh... What do you mean? Oh, okay, okay, I for... You serious? Bro, how do I move without getting killed? My sanity is negative. Jump! You can climb the fucking box, dude. Bro, this is horrifying. There. I, um... Uh... Run, dude. Run, dude. Jump. 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 Great! Alright, I, I... I'm kinda getting the hang of these jumps, right? I don't know where the... where the... That's horrifying, dude. I need to jump across, jump. Now run. And jump, right? Jump, jump, get in. Alright. Before I do anything, I need to... I need to... I need to... Refill my lantern. That's what I need to. Right? How do I get past him when he is this... How do I get past him when he is this close? Where is he? I hate this with every portion of my body. Jump. Jump! Oh my god, he doesn't wanna climb! He doesn't wanna climb, Daniel, you fucking cunt. Climb it. Phenomenal. What's this? Here, take a take a torso. No way. I don't know where I'm going, I don't know. No, do I actually... But I... Throw it very far away. Can I pick it up? Yes, I can. Alright. Pro strats, right? Pro strats. I'll get this close. Right. I don't know where you are. But, uh... Here, take a... Take a... Take a hand. Can I? Yes, I can. Fucking turn it around, Daniel. Hurry the hell up. I have never spun a mouse in my life this fast. Turn it. Run. Close the door. What now? Can I just open this? 
Okay, did I miss a key? Did I actually miss a key? Okay, I don't want to do this anymore, dude. Something large brushed against his leg and felt himself being dragged along by the current of the beast. He pushed himself above the surface. Help, he cried as the ocean swallowed him again. Phenomenal, more water. No, no, okay. Just... Bro, where? Where am I supposed to go? Okay. Bro, fuck this, dude. Fuck it, no, no, I'm not looking back. I know it sounds loud, right? I know, again, left, I don't care. I know it sounds loud, he's probably miles away, right? Did I went? That does not sound like miles away. Run, run, don't look back, don't look back, don't look back, don't look back. Door, help me. He felt himself being hoisted out of the ocean, the lacquered hull of Essence Hortensia glittered in the soothing yo warm yellow light of a setting sun. He turned his head to the calm ocean, reaching towards the cows to Portugal and thought, is this another dream? No, my guy, this is not another dream. This is horror. Okay. I think I'm gonna leave this episode here, you guys. I, uh... I don't ever wanna do that again. Sound... Loud sounds makes, bro, such a big difference. <laughs> if you like the video, please leave a like, comment if you want to, uh, and you guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I hope I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.